welcome everyone joining us by video. And I welcome you, Bishop Hollerith. Thank you. What a joy to see you and to take this moment to give thanks for your ministry in this diocese. Thank you. Well, I give thanks for you all and for what you've done to remember my ministry. I'm deeply uh, appreciative of that. Thank you. Bishop Hollerith, as we debut you, your portrait, it serves to remind us of how grace-filled your many years of ministry were here. And it serves to remind me both that I have big shoes to fill and that I am supported by such a firm foundation of faithful Episcopal ministry. Absolutely. Shall we take a look? Yep. It's quite gratifying to see uh, a younger and thinner self memorialized in such a matter. <laughs> Well, I look forward to passing by this portrait frequently and remembering how very gracious you have been in supporting me as I try to carry on this ministry. So thank, thank you. It's been my privilege to do so. Let us pray. Gracious God, we give you thanks for Bishop Hollerith's faithful life and service in the Diocese of Southern Virginia. We ask your continued grace and guidance for Holly and Lizzie that they will find in retirement fruitful opportunities for rest and renewal, even as we continue to enjoy the fruits of their labors. Bless this portrait, that it will serve for all who pass by it as an icon of your son's witness and sacrifice for the love and salvation of the whole world. And loving God, I pray your strength and guidance to be upon Susan as she continues this apostolic ministry in the diocese. I pray your blessing upon Susan and Tom that their life may be filled with joy and be a sign of your promised heavenly feast at which they each will hear the words finally, well done, good and faithful servant. We pray this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.